What's going on guys? Um, today I will be showing you this new ROM that I have installed on my Xperia S. Uh, the reason I installed it was because it could be installed on the custom uh, on the stock kernel, which is pretty easy because then you only have to install the ROM and the Google Apps, and then you've got it. So no going into fast boot and um, yeah, uh, installing ADB drivers and all that stuff. Uh, you just need to put it on your SD card and install it from uh, install from zip from in the custom recovery and then you've got it. Um, the thing I like so much about it is that it has yeah so it's a really simple display so it's like iPhone it hasn't got uh, a menu to get in it's just all on the home page and to keep it a bit more organized I've got all the apps I don't really need in a folder and I put it at the bottom so here are all the folders. Um, it's proven that it uses a lot less battery than the stock ROM. As you can see here, the RAM it is using is ridiculous. It's only using 12% of my 1 gig. So that's a, a on ZD Box software, which is a widget, which is just to, to kill all, you know, just to kill all the apps. Well, it's only using 12% now. And I haven't touched anything. You can also kill all the apps just by going here, then you've got this little all your apps here. You can lock your apps to make sure they don't lock, uh, that they don't get killed, and to get them away, you just go like that. And of course, you can just press this button, and it will just kill them all. Um, yeah, it's got the main stuff uh, the normal stock ROM has, but it's just got loads of extra more features like sliding this down. You get your brightness here. You get all these these shortcuts everywhere and then your notifications will be left I don't have any at this moment uh, there was also more here and it brings you to another page it's not very good with white backgrounds but that's because my themes are clashing but it says all stuff you can add there uh, th I also have to mention the themes are absolutely crazy um, it's all these are my local themes so these are the ones I already have downloaded and then you got online and then these are all the ones that are online, it just keeps on going the list, it's infinity, it's ridiculous how many there are and then you've got the right tab is mix, it says mix here and then you can mix all your themes, so you've got here you've got your lock screen you can change your lock screen and then you can change your lock screen wallpaper, you can change your icons so I've got all different themes and every single thing is from a different theme which is a very cool feature also um, I would like to mention what it's look like on the wait here this is a uh, the about phone part it's, so it's a MUI ROM and it's just on the on the stock kernel so it's a custom ROM and it comes with its own market store as well and its own system updates because it's actually a Chinese company that makes this ROM so here are the system updates checking for updates it says but I've normally got the latest version anyway at the top you can also change the battery bar is just this stripe and the more battery you have the higher, uh, the bigger the longer the stripe would be which is pretty cool to see so you don't have that battery thing and also it says how much internet you're using here so at this moment I'm using 0, 0.00 kilobytes a second now it's on 0, 0, 0, 0.02 it's, it's handy to know so that you make sure you don't uh, use too much uh, yeah like memory of your 3G or 4 or, yeah 3G or whatever um, yeah, so uh, that's about it. The, there are some more features I can show you. So if you keep your finger touched on the main screen, you can see all your widgets at the bottom. And then you can just look for a free space and then get a widget, hold it and drag it on to wherever you want. And then here, there's the widget now. So yeah, um, also everything has got its own settings menu that is very, um, how would I say it? It's very like, advanced so there's a lot of stuff you can change in your settings on every on every application so you've got your preview here this will bring it all and you can change choose on what your widgets come from your downloads so now all my downloads are coming here on this screen you can just change it to that one so now it will all add whether there is space uh, the music player is also crazy I must say um, don't know why this album cover is here it's not my genre but here you got all your music and it's got this really good equalizer it's crazy how good the equalizer is 
Um, I'm just going to go to all my songs, look for a good song. Um, I will get this one. Here, there's some drum and bass. So then here you have it. Uh, if you got that, here normally you've got your karaoke stuff so you can sing along because Chinese people like to do that. Um, here's the equalizer and you can do it by... Well, I'll turn my music down so that I can hear you, so that you can hear me. Uh, edit. Uh, equalizer settings and here it is and it was, it's just crazy I mean this has got my headphones to a whole new level of bass and yeah adapt and uh, adapting uh, your music style so yeah um, try it out yourself um, I found it on XDA developers so I'll put the link to the XDA developers well thanks XDA developers for uh, posting it and thanks to Mui for making this ROM it's a really good company because uh, it's got a market store here um, wait, no, this is user feedback so you can give feedback and all that it's got its own antivirus it comes rooted of course and it's market you can't do much with it though I would stay with the play store because it's all in Chinese as you can see you can't translate the market store it's all Chinese writing so you don't use this uh, you just get everything off the play store it comes with antivirus, anti-spam um, a yeah, nice camera um, you can manage your apps, it comes with loads of extra features, so then again, um, yeah, enjoy it. Uh, last thing I want to show you is the music player, is pretty cool. So this is the lock screen, um, I've changed the background of it. Here you can unlock, you know, like unlock the camera and all that. If you tap it twice, it becomes the music player, and then you can just change all your songs like this, and it comes with the nice bars of the sound that is playing. Let's give an example. So here you can see all the things. It's pretty cool. So yeah, as I said, try it out for yourself and enjoy the ROM. Um, please subscribe and comment and rate if you want to mention anything. And I will be showing you ROMs the, this coming month. I'm, gonna, I'm now busy trying to install the 4.2.2 ROM. Uh, pa Paranoid ROM or something it's called I'm not sure yet well I'm gonna see you about that one see how it is I'm really happy with this ROM anyway because you didn't have to change much with the kernel and all that but yeah um, I'll keep you posted